Welcome to Awesome Code. Please subscribe to my channel. In this video, we will learn about map, filter, and reduce functions. The map, filter, and reduce functions are three built-in functions that are most often used in conjunction with lambda functions. They are mostly used in function style Python programming. Map function syntax is map and function and et variable map function applies the func function argument to every item of iterable you can also pass more iterables to the map function if you do so map will consume elements from each iterable simultaneously let's see an example of map to calculate the square of the first 10 positive integer including 0 we can use map and then we can pass in lambda i and i then two asterisk sign and with two and then range of 10 so this way each item of the iterable uh, will be used in this expression and then we need to just to uh, get as the list so we are going to pass this whole thing to a list and we also want to print it a console so we are going to surround it with the print function save and run and here is the output we can also use map function over multiple iterables of different sizes let's, let's use map and pass in a print function to print in a range of 10 and range of five range of ten again and we need as a list so we are going to pass into this whole thing into a list we need to remove extra this And there is one extra over here. And here is the output. And now the filter function. Filter function take function and iterable. Such as filter. And it takes function. Iterable. It works similarly to map by evaluating input elements one by one. But unlike map function, the filter function does not transform input elements into new values, but allow us to filter out those input values that meet the predicate defined by the function argument. Let's see example of filter function. We will create list of even numbers in a range from 0 to 9 e ones and here we are going to use filter and our lambda expression this will be our num for number and our num Odd by two if it is equal to zero and the range passing ten and 
this will create a list of even numbers from 0 to 9 we can print print with f spring even numbers and over here we need to print as a list and we are going to pass in our evens save and run and here is the list of our even numbers from 0 to 8 but our range is from 0 to 9. So our filter function is evaluating uh, each element over here with expression. We take, for example, 0 over here, 1 or 2, and apply the expression of this lambda. Now we are going to learn about reduce function. The reduce also take function and iterable, but work completely opposite to the map function. Instead of taking items of iterable and mapping them to the fun return, function return values in a one by one fashion, it cumulatively performs operation specified by, by function to all iterable variable items we have. Let's see example of reduce function to some values of elements contained in various iterable objects. For this we need to import reduce. So I'm just going to add the import statement from func tools import reduce so I will use reduce and our lambda expression again and this will be our two and these are our two arguments x comma y x comma y then we are going to add these two x plus y and their values just for and for value of x and y and then we are going to print the result that should be 8 let's just save it and run and when I can say the output is 8, the sum of x and y. To keep on learning, please subscribe to my channel. Awesome code, keep supporting me, and thank you for watching.